YouTube, what's going on? Andrew Darling here, Mr. Darling 4. I want to run you through my quick first day um, battery life on my Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge. Um, so obviously here's the Galaxy S6 Edge. I'm just casting the stuff up to my TV here. Um, really good hardware design. I mean, I, I really like the feel of the device overall. Um, the camera hump doesn't seem to bother me at all. Um, so here we go. As you can tell up here at the top, it says 8.30 in the morning. That's when we started. We were at 100%. So one hour later, um, 9.30, we were already down to 75%, and we'd already cut um, quite a bit of the estimated usage off. So at the 9.30 in the morning, uh, we'd only been at a screen on time for 37 minutes, uh, 9 seconds. Not too terrible, but uh, really, really not that good. So I'm going to show you guys. I was uploading quite a bit of videos um, during this time. This is at 9.38, so eight minutes after the last screenshot. Um, it had already dropped significantly. As those videos were uploading, um, once we got to 10.30 in the morning, um, we were already down to 45%. So as you can tell, um, estimated time remaining was about five hours. Um, and at this point, at 10.30 in the morning, uh, we'd actually had one hour and 15 minutes of screen on time. So this is just my quick first day. Uh, like I said, as we got all the way to 11.30, we were already down to 27%. And it was just, it was, it was not looking good for us, okay? So we were three hours uh, and eight seconds off of the charger. As you look down here, the three main things that were taking up the, uh, the most power, of course, the screen, OneDrive was backing everything up, and then YouTube, I was uploading everything to. And then at this point, we had one hour, 46 minutes of screen on time. So going all the way to 1230, we were already down to 15%, only had about an hour and a half left of usage. And we were, we were struggling at that point. So the same three culprits, screen, OneDrive, and YouTube, of course. And then at this point, we only had two hours and 19 minutes of screen on time. I've kind of chronicled this on my uh, Google Plus page, but I just wanted to give a quick update here. So by the time we got to basically the, uh, the, the end of life here, so the go ahead and, and fill the battery up. Um, we need to uh, go ahead and charge the device. At this point was 1.30, and same three culprits, the screen, OneDrive, and YouTube. And at this point, we had two hours and 51 minutes of screen on time. So yes, this is extremely hard use. This is not a typical morning's use. Uh, so at that point, from 1.30, I went ahead and charged it up. So at the uh, 2.30 mark, we were, all the way, we were already back up to 54%. Uh, which is a pretty pretty decent charge rate. I wasn't on a fast charger. I was at a 2.4 amp out on one of my uh, external chargers. And then after that, uh, the next time I took a screenshot was at 334. So by 330, it was already charged at 100%. I just didn't get a screenshot in. So I took it off the battery then at that point. And then when we got to 430 this evening, um, we were already down 13%. So a little bit uh, less usage at this time. I got it all the way charged back up. Um, I actually took a couple photos, which I think turned out really well. Um, of course, with this just being uh, cast to the TV, uh, the color reproduction may or may not be where it needs to be. But I took a couple photos, and I'm kind of proud of them. I mean, I really like the camera so far. Battery life, of course, is going to be an issue. So I continued to take screenshots a uh, full 12 hours. So we started at 8.30 in the morning. This is 5.30, so this is after being charged. And we're already back down to uh, 75%, but this is over two hours. It took us two hours with pretty normal use to get back down to 75%. And we've been just a little under two hours of being off the charger, about an hour screen on time. So while this is still not ideal compared to the OnePlus One, uh, which is kind of the standard for me for battery, this is definitely better than this morning, and it's probably on par with you know what a, an average user or an average consumer would anticipate. So just keeping here, uh, by 6.30, we were down to 62%, and at that point, we had an hour and 36 minutes of screen on time, just about an hour and 37. After that, at 19.30 or 7.30 p.m., we were down to 49%. And we had two hours and six minutes of screen on time. So I just took my final screenshot uh, not too long ago at 8.30. And at 8.30, we were down to 36% already. 
And at about 8.30, I let my son kind of play around a little bit with the games and whatnot. And we're not even to 9.30 at night yet. And I can just show you directly on the phone. Obviously, I can't really cast it. Um, but if you can tell right there, I don't know how blurry it's probably going to be. But it's at uh, it's 9.24 and we're down to 15% already. So while I really enjoy what the phone does uh, photo-wise as far as quality and, and stuff of that nature, the battery life is just not, not doing it for me. So uh, my son and I, I took a little goofy picture with him, a little goofy selfie. Um, that's my joker. That's my dude. Um, I took a, I sent one to my kids earlier when I was still at work, um, you know, with the front facing camera, very clear. Um, don't talk about my LeBron James hairline. I'm kind of sensitive, but overall the galaxy S six edge is, is pretty solid. But when it comes to the battery life at the end of the day, it's really just not, not where it needs to be. So like I said, I got some good uh, stuff up on my YouTube channel. So definitely go to the uh, channel, like, and subscribe. It's Mr. Darling four. And that's going to be the same on Twitter, on YouTube, Instagram, Vine, got a whole bunch of fun stuff, but we'll go back to my personal favorite photo that I've taken so far. Just pretty good, vibrant colors, a uh, pretty interesting thing. And this is by the walkway by where I work. So that was basically my first day, kind of initial impressions of battery life. I, I assume it's going to get better. Um, phones tend to, uh, for me at least, um, I don't even have all my Gmails synced to this phone yet, so we'll see what happens. But YouTube, have a great rest of your day. I'm trying to get a bunch of videos up uh, in the month of April. So this is April 1st, but no April Fools. Y'all have a great rest of your day, and we'll talk to you soon.